with 8.50 to play in the second quarter. Now he throws over the middle, White open, splits two defenders, Williams and Clark, and going up to the stands to say hello. Raise that hangs in the center of the facility, and that is up. And we have not seen anything come close to hitting the ceiling. So on, they take over, and on the first play, the quarterback, Bailey, throwing out of his own end zone, just lobs one up down the field. He's in the backfield. It's McCain, Head, and Bloom on in the receiver package. And now a bad throw by KJ as Head, the new receiver, was crossing. He threw it behind him, and it's picked off and run back for a touchdown. And the big man punts it into the stands. Defense. Bailey forced out on the blitz by McDermott. Got a wide open man crossing over the middle. That is Keith Stokes, and he's all the way down inside the five before Simmons and Abdullah hit him into the wall. Black in the shotgun. Give underneath to Crenshaw, and he's free. And Andre Crenshaw is going to have his fifth touchdown of the ball game fourth on the ground had one leg tackle he had to break out of right at the line of scrimmage and on the road KJ got time fires the head who bobbled it now made a move he's got in the middle of the field inside the five bangs off a tackle and gets across the goal line head almost dropped it ever let alone in a professional arena something you might see at a third grade youth basketball tournament Black in the shotgun, surveys, flushed out, got a block. He's got some open real estate. McCain trying to block down at the five, inside, touchdown. K.J. Black with 109 to play. Points to hang on, and they're going to get their first win, 51-47. to 47. And the Cedar Rapids Titans now fall to 2-6 and six on the year.